Yo, what is up, everybody? It is Green back from Team GB Elite. Today, I am doing, um, what's it called? Black Ops 2 Marathon. Every single mission, I hope. I may not get down to it, but it doesn't matter. You can see the first couple missions, if I don't do the last ones, on Black Ops 2, because we're celebrating the start of Black Ops 3, which beta comes out in less than a week. Now, I don't know what is going on with my audio. I do not have any audio right now, but yeah, I can't hear anything and my TV audio is super loud. I don't know what that's about. Stupid PS3. That's why I use PS4 now. Jonas Savimbi. Uh, this was actually a real person. My dad fought under Jonas Savimbi's command when he fought uh, BMPLA in South Africa. Kind of. Joe's. Jonas Savimbi was militia leader, and he was faking to be militia, so he actually took under his command. I don't know, it's a long story. My dad's a badass. Anyways, uh, this first mission is kind of where my dad fought in Angola. Through a uh, bush, and in here in the deserts and stuff. The Buffalo, South African vehicle. And they're actually supplied uh, with the money and everything from the CIA to fight the Russians. I know, this isn't a history channel, whatever. Um, and so they took some orders from the CIA. It's pretty interesting. I don't know. If you know my dad, ask him. I just pressed triangle to get off the vehicle. This is not GTA. I keep going for GTA controls. And the FNFAL that I'm using right now is a gun my dad actually used. And not to nerf the ones that's in zombies that's super not powerful. This gun actually has the stats of like a Gatling gun, except lighter. 6,000 rounds per minute, uh, 7.62 caliber. It's a powerful gun. It's also like impossible to control with all its recoil. But. Uh, that is so annoying not being able to hear audio. I don't know what I make these motors for. It's a garbage game. So this is not a gun my dad used. Ooh, I love this gold camo on it too. Wow, uh, why am I sucking so bad at quick scopes? I'm better than this, I swear. I'm so used to seeing the 100 hit marker, I'm not sure if I'm actually killing him. Did I just get hit by a mortar? Take cover! Who's killing me? There is so much auto aim in this game. You know what? Ooh, I can call air support. I can't hear the commands going off. I don't know if you guys can hear the commands because you're uh, listening through a different device. Okay, that's weird. My controller just glitched, made me jump and shoot. Oh, it's not by my doing. See? I'm not firing right now, and it's firing for me. Oh, my old PS4. This controller is like 100 years old. That's probably why it's not working. I'm just surviving off of auto aim. I never even aim down during all that.
Ah, I can't fire a grenade launcher at him. This is a hard one where it's, you have to kill everyone. Damn it, I didn't kill the last guy. I just needed one more guy for my career record thing. See, it just jumped and shot. I didn't shoot. You know what? I may have to switch controllers. This controller is ancient. Why is my PS4 controller, but it's not connecting very well. Oh yeah, I have a giant sword right now, don't I? So, I tried to give myself a gun attachment my dad had, other than the ACOG. My dad did not have an ACOG. He used iron sights. But I have a grenade launcher, the extended mags. Actually, he used tape mags. I don't know why I put extended mags on. Never mind, I failed that. Lateral. Man, I'm failing this. So then be Man, you can't quick scope while moving, it doesn't work. And here comes Hudson in his little helicopter. No, I'm going to try something and see if it works for audio. Which one's media output and which one's going to Elgato? You're going to Elgato. You're all going to Elgato. If I unplug... No, I don't want to unplug anything and mess up my video. I've already gone a bit too long in my video. Never mind, guys. I'm going to change controllers, though, so I don't look like an idiot jumping and shooting. Let's see if this controller works. Bam! Right in the head. <laughs> My audio happens uh, five seconds earlier for you guys. So it's like, whoa, he predicted the future. Except we've all played this game before, so... How long has this video gone? Nine minutes? That's not bad. I would listen to all of this, but I know for a fact um, that it's not going through my Elgato, so skip. wondered how that uh, RPG curved to hit us. I just realized it's Valkyrie. He looked familiar. Quick scope. I'm failing this so bad. Why am I failing? I'm even hard scoping now. Okay, now I'm hit markering. I'm getting so mad. Alright. F in power. I look like 
I suck so bad in this mission. This mission and I are not doing with each other. Not to mention, I, I don't know why, but I work so much better with surround sound than no sound. Who is killing me? What the hell? Zen, stop shooting me. Is that guy on a jet ski? I don't understand. What's going on? You like the ground? This guy's got shitty recoil. I've always wondered if end game time still passes while you do this, so I'm like missing time on shooting the barges. My controller's just vibrating, I can't even hear it shooting. Boarding the boat, but I want to take this guy out. That's in. You're gonna have to deal with him. All right, now I'll deal with him. Oh wait, are we up there? Do grenades even stay on the boats in this game? I don't think they work. Refill ammo, and I'll get more grenades so I can test this. Yeah, they come from flying right back. Where are these guys? I know they're around here somewhere, but. Jump shot. If I dolphin die, will kill me. That wasn't a dolphin die, but... I guess press circle to reload. That's GTA, not... God. How is that big enough to stop me in this game? All the things I've jumped over in this game. Okay, that worked. Can't hear my orders up saying it's a good thing I've played this mission like a hundred times before. game before I ever actually played Black Ops 1, so I had no idea what they were talking about. I had no idea it actually had to do with anything from Black Ops 1. The storyline in this, if you play them all in order, is so amazing. If you've ever done that from World uh, War uh, to Black Ops 1, which you'll see connections to Black Ops 1. Uh, a lot of people don't think there are, but there are. Invented Black Ops 2. Okay, what I'm mad about Black Ops 3 is Tricky Vic. 
Victor Reznov. They, it doesn't seem like they're really going to answer um, what Reznov had to do in Black Ops 2. Which one do I want to trade out? I'm going to trade out my Ballista. Did I miss that shot? I do any damage to him. Ammo crate. What mission was it where the character kept yelling about ammo crates at gold mine? Okay, that would have taken him down. I know heights are like tanks. But still, that was a missile to the rotor. That was a fail. How come I wasn't even firing there? Where am I now? Ow. I need to get my gun. No, 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 no. Let me grab my gun. Let me grab my ballista. Damn it. I wanted that ballista. There's woods. Poor guy got torn from saving my life. They weren't going to those wrists. But like a torture area. That part of the arm. You notice Hudson gets to carry a pistol and Woods gets to carry a pistol and he carries him? But when I carry him, no, no one gets a weapon. See, this is the kind of environment my dad worked in. In Angola, he called it the bush, I believe. And everything you're about to see, the Cubans, the Russians, he killed them all, Angolans. My dad is one of the few people in the Cold War. I actually got to kill a Russian, which is a pretty cool fact for the Cold War, because not a lot of people did. It was a war in America. America never fired a shot at him. It's quite funny. He also got to kill Cubans, which I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, we killed him in the Bay of Pigs. I was going to say, I'm not sure if we actually fought him, but we took him out in like one huge battle. You know what? Well, I'm just waiting here because I don't want to get left behind. I need to look up virtual riot for background music. Oh no, he's moving. I can't get virtual riot. Oh yes, I can. Because I'm awesome like that. Multitask.
Wait, do I have my ballista? No, I don't. I need to find the dragon off. Alright. I need a rosewater around there. Man, yeah, it takes forever to hang down the site. I want to kill the Mendoz, but I know it ends the mission. That would end the entire game right there, though, if I killed Mendez and ran. And it's not like it'd be a confirmed end of a mission right there, either, because, um, it ends up the same thing, us running away with the entire thing. I don't think on this, so, I should have shot him. For some great lines here, I'm so sad that I don't have any audio. So I blow his eye out, and that's why he has the glass eye and is able to take over the world. Oh, I don't want to do any spoilers, uh, but with it in the later missions. I can't hear Hudson's commands to know what I'm supposed to do. How do I arm it with mortars? There. You want to do it over the red? Alright, yeah, so let's get ready to build the pain of a dragon off. Oh wow, yeah, you're gonna suck. You can already tell I'm not gonna like this dragon off. Ow! What the hell, RPGs? Right. I'm just gonna keep moving around so no one can hit me. Where is it? What the hell? How? This game! It works so much better if you can hear, trust me. When you can't hear shit, it doesn't work. You can't quick scope with a dragon off. I don't like the dragon off. Yeah, this has to be the worst gun in the game. Duck to be in PLA, except you're Cubans. What happened? Not a single person died from that. Alright, I'm just gonna shoot you. Nope, still not killing anyone. I suck. get killed by the animal trap. Just sending grenades everywhere. I'm not even watching where I'm shooting. Lateral. He's gonna do so much. My dad also used Claymore, so yeah, I'm totally going with his loadouts. Ammo box! Which means now I can shoot you. Is 
just like massacring everyone. Oh, these grenades. I hate those mortars. I always end up getting killed by those mortars. Grenade, grenade. Let's move us in. Try following these. I got your woods. And leaders of envy to come to save our lives. Unfortunately, this great man got assassinated. I don't remember what year, but you can't kill me. Thanks to your old man. Oh wait, no, that comes later. It's like trying to recite the game. I don't know guys, maybe I'll do this in the last episode. Not the last episode, the last mission. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. This has been Grant from Team GB Elite signing off. Remember, like, favorite, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I will see you in the next.